Both legal men are in the ring and set to start things off here. We're ready to go. Oh my God. Oh, crushing the knee here. Beautiful technique. the tag opponent off the ropes oh what a close line forcefully delivered There have been times in sports entertainment when unlikely duos have formed and over time they develop and bond and become an outstanding tag team combination. The team that immediately comes to mind is the powerhouse duo of Cesaro and Sheamus. After their thrilling best of seven series, I wouldn't think they'd develop into a top tag team. Dropped it with a big shoulder tackle. Uh -oh. I don't think anyone thought Cesaro and Sheamus would develop into a premier tag team. Over time, the superstars realized that they were better as allies than as enemies. And when they combined their incredible strength, the results were something that couldn't be ignored. It was really unbelievable to witness the evolution of Cesaro and Sheamus as a team. We saw them improve every week and conquer a variety of opponents. To see the Swiss Cyborg and Celtic Warrior go from unwilling partners to WWE Raw Tag Team Champions was truly impressive. In a tag team contest, a superstar and partner lock up against another duo. Unless there's a special stipulation added to the match, the traditional rules of a singles match apply in terms of winning the match via pinfall, submission, countout, or disqualification. In WWE, there's as much chaos outside the ring as there is inside the ring. Try working with Saxton at ringside. In a standard tag team match, one competitor is in the ring against an opponent, and their teammate is in their corner standing on the ring apron. I should also point out that the competitor in the ring, as far as the referee is concerned, is the legal man. Only the legal man can attempt to score a fall over an opponent or be defeated by an opponent. In a tag match, when a superstar tags their partner, the person who tagged out has until the referee's count of five to exit the ring. For a tag to be considered legal, both of the superstar's feet have to be on the apron. The partner must be touching the tag rope in the corner. Both team members must touch, and the referee must see the tag be made. When you talk about great tag teams, we can go all the way back to teams like the Tolos brothers, Stevens and Patterson, Stevens and Bockwinkle. The Texas Outlaws, the Briscoes, the Blackjacks, the Andersons, and the list goes on and on. When you're part of a tag team, the two partners have to travel together, train together, eat together, and be completely in sync with one another. Tag team competition dates back all the way to the early 1900s. Corey, you mentioned some of the classic duos from sports entertainment's incredible history. In today's WWE, the tag team scene has never been more competitive. I don't know who has the edge when it comes to talent, if it's Raw or SmackDown Live. I think it's too close to call, but all the teams truly think and act as one unit. I agree, Michael. Teams such as the Usos, American Alpha, Anderson and Gallows, The New Day, The Hardy Boys, Cesaro and Sheamus. I could be here all day naming championship caliber teams. And when the tag team scene is that competitive, you don't know which team will be wearing the gold. Over the last few years, the tag team scene in WWE is hotter than it's ever been. 
One of the teams that has shined brighter than any other is the New Day. Xavier Woods, Big E, and Kofi Kingston are two-time tag team champions. But it was their second reign that put the New Day name in WWE history books forever. The tag team competition right now is as heated as it's ever been since the Attitude Era. Everywhere you look, there's another tremendous tag team combination looking to make a run at the WWE Tag Team Gold. When we talk about the New Day, the team won a fatal four-way match in their second tag team title reign at 2015's SummerSlam. I may think the power of positivity stinks like a bag of rotting garbage, and that Woods, Kingston, and Big E are idiots, but I'll give the New Day this. They're one of the greatest tag teams ever, and what put them in that category was when their tag team championship reign lasted a record-setting 483 days. Even though AJ Styles deemed himself the champ that runs the camp to annoy John Cena, he really has thrived as a leader of various factions and teams. Yeah, Styles led the club back before the WWE draft separated that iconic faction, but he also led one of the most dominant groups in Japanese wrestling history. Oh boy, he is rolling. Oh, that's unnecessary. Graves, that Japanese faction was good, but becoming a leader in WWE is what matters. Styles did that as SmackDown Live's team captain at Survivor Series. And during that match, Styles' own teammate Dean Ambrose ended up powerbombing AJ and aiding in his elimination. But in the end, SmackDown won, which means that Captain Styles won too. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Oh, this is not good at all. The pen. Oh, the reversal by AJ Styles. Look. Oh. <laughs> Here's his moment, Michael. Oh, man. AJ Styles is in trouble. Oh, my God. Is crushing it. We know what's coming here. Leg drop. It's effective. AJ's in big trouble. Got the shoulders down. And he stops the count. Scott Hall turns it around. In May of 2017, SmackDown Live saw an incredible women's tag team match when Charlotte Flair and Becky Lynch squared off against welcoming committee members Natalya and Carmella. The rivalry between these women got so intense that Naomi was in Flair and Lynch's corner, and Tamina was in Natalya and Carmella's corner. What a reversal by AJ Styles. Styles is always thinking. I think only a group as treacherous as the welcoming committee. Styles clash. If that doesn't end it, I don't know what will. A handle applied. Ooh, a gut buster. That was all sorts of nasty. Strong oh, kick. My goodness. Too quick for him there. He's stumbling some now. During the rivalry between the Hardy Boys and Cesaro and Sheamus over the Raw Tag Team Championship, the teams became very familiar with one another. In June of 2017, the teams met in a two out of three falls bout on Monday Night Raw. The most important fall in a two out of three falls contest is the first fall. If a team can win the first fall, that sets the tone for the rest of the match and your opponents are playing catch-up. The two out of three falls match that saw the Hardy Boys go at it with Cesaro and Sheamus was a throwback of sorts. Throughout the 1960s and 70s, championship title defenses and grudge matches were often decided in the two out of three falls format. Cesaro and Sheamus didn't waste any time and scored the decisive first fall after a bro kick rocked Jeff Hardy. Cesaro and Sheamus wanted to continue their domination of Team Extreme, but the Hardys had other ideas as Matt tied things up at one fall apiece after a twist of fate on the Swiss Cyborg. After a swanton bomb by Jeff Hardy, the match broke down and the third fall was ruled a double countout. Oh man, what a nasty STO. 
There it is. The tag has been made. Oh, he needed that in the worst way, Michael. Oh, the nasty impact. And it's Hall showing some agility. The big man's quick. And there's the tag. AJ Styles into the ring. Clean on the back elbow. Nobody controls the pace of a match quite like this guy. He's lining him up. Here we go. AJ Styles setting up. AJ Styles able to avoid damage there. Such a technician. Scott Hall turns it around. Looking for the finish. Scott Hall has got it right where he wants him. Up and... AJ's in big trouble now. Shoulders on the mat. Wait a minute. There goes the ref. Man down. Oh my goodness. Crushing it. Dodges that one. Ooh, what impact. Versus it. He's not in a good spot here, guys. He simply needs to find a way to regroup. Boom, what impact. And look at hung up on the second. There may be no stopping him. This could mean trouble. Now with complete control. What's he gonna do with gaining some extra leverage here? Concern for the rules. Oh my, how in the world did he kick out of that? This is amazing! Nailed it! AJ Styles with a nice reversal. And it's Hall showing some agility. The big man's quick. I don't know how much more Scott Hall can endure. Don't count the bad guy out yet. I don't recall the last time he looked so fatigued. He has got to do something quick. Yeah, but guys, Hall still has some machismo left in him. Oh, look at this. Oh, pump handle. Oh, and a gut buster. Ooh, look out. Schoolboy for the win. Uh, too close for cover. Not yet. And it's Hall showing some agility. The big man's quick. Vertical suplex. Nice. Setting him up for the... Harsh impact. Gotta wonder how this is gonna end, Byron. Whatever happens, it's not gonna be good. I can tell you that. Scott Hall isn't being shy, but he better stay focused right now. We all know Scott Hall is dangerous, but you have to remember he enjoys nothing more than hurting and humiliating his opponents. You've got to believe this one's over. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Back in from the floor. He's getting after it while he has the energy. Smart move. I think we're about to see it. Step through. Styles crash. This one's over. Here he goes for the win. Can he close it out? How does he keep doing this? Wow, even now, after all that punishment, Scott Hall digs deep to power out. Styles, Styles rolls through. Tap pressure. Warm up the bus. This one is over. We're seeing another reason why Hall's had such a great career. Choke slam. AJ's in big trouble now. 
in off the tag. He goes for the cover. He kicks out before three. He is not going to go down without a fight, Michael. These superstars have tried everything. They have something left in their arsenal. They have to, but can they dig down deep enough to find it? Taking on any more damage here could very well mean the beginning of the end. Oh, close line! This is his opportunity to win this thing. He wants it one more time. Leg drop! Wow, I'm just as surprised as you guys are. Looking for all the glory here. Two! Got him up! Oh, that might have just broken something. Scott Hall turns it around. AJ Styles moved out of the way there. This might be it! Oh, my! Boom! What impact! Boom! Great effort from both these teams, guys, but at this point, both sides look to be struggling here. Oh, the reversal by AJ Styles. How these superstars are even still in this match is beyond me, especially given how intense the match has been. Things are not looking very good right now. Going to have to find a way to regroup. Look at this. Oh, my goodness. You jam your leg in a bad way. I can't believe everything that's transpired thus far. It's been so physical. Comes in off the tag. Amazingly, neither side looking to give in here, guys. I don't think we could have asked for a more exciting match. Oh, boy, he is rolling. Not where he wants to be right now. Hey, he got himself. What a clothesline. Ouch. That's what he was looking for, Michael. Well, AJ Styles is trying to get in his opponent's head right here. Caught with the elbow. Right on the jaw. His shoulders are down. One, two. I don't know too many other guys that would have been able to kick out of that. How'd he do that? And it's Hall showing some agility. The big man's quick. And he's taken down with authority. I think I felt the ground shake on that one. Here he goes. Rolling cutter. Now it's time to capitalize. There's a pin now. One, two, 
three. They did it. They won the match. Win despite absorbing a huge amount of punishment there. These two work so well together, Michael. I'd be surprised if they went their separate ways anytime soon. Guys, I have to say, that was an amazing match.